Ladies and gentlemen, and everything in between, please welcome Australia's fastest rising star, Danielle Walker! <laughs> Hello everybody, hello. Uh, it's nice to be here. Um, my name is Danielle um, and I'm originally from Townsville. Uh, yucky. <laughs> I, was, I was on the phone uh, to my mum like a few weeks ago um, and she told me that she got some laser hair removal done. Um, and she said she got it done to her underarms and her bikini line. Because uh, she said she didn't want to get rid of it all, you know, she didn't want to go the whole hog. Because <laughs> 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 um, she didn't want to look like a little girl. <laughs> and I was just like, Mum, <laughs> nobody <laughs> is mistaking you <laughs> for a little girl. <laughs> you have not aged well. <laughs> Like, more likely, someone would mistake you for a witch. <laughs> but like a witch with a real neat puss. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I think it was like my overwhelming honesty uh, <laughs> that my boyfriend fell in love with. Um, <laughs> But uh, something I've noticed uh, since being in the relationship is like I'm really bad at giving out compliments. Uh, like here's a compliment I gave out recently uh, whilst trying to be alluring uh, <laughs> during intimate times. I said, uh, ooh, <laughs> that's a crisp dick you have there. <laughs> so crisp. <laughs> like an iceberg lettuce. <laughs> We did not proceed. No. <laughs> um, but we're still together. Uh, and uh, we recently, we went on a trip to Scotland together. Um, and I drew, I drew some pictures of the trip. Uh, so here they are. Alrighty, uh, so this is the first one. Uh, there it is there. Um, <laughs> it's just me and my boyfriend there. Oh, we're on the Loch Ness Monster together. <laughs> Um, and that there, that's just like our hands sort of just nearly touching, you know? <laughs> it's called chemistry. <laughs> Learn about it. <laughs> um, but this is my theory about the Loch Ness Monster, right? Like most people, they think the Loch Ness Monster um, is this big prehistoric dinosaur called the Plesiosaur that looks like that, right? <laughs> But whilst I was in Scotland, I watched upwards of two documentaries. <laughs> and most scientists believe that if there is a Loch Ness Monster, most likely it's just this big, stupid, grey-looking fish called the sturgeon that looks like that, right? <laughs> How stupid does it look? <laughs> I hate its stupid little face. <laughs> But in Scotland, they have a pretty big tourism industry, right? Um, and tourists buy a lot of souvenirs. And in Scotland, they only really have souvenirs of three things, right? Uh, they have souvenirs of the Loch Ness Monster, they have souvenirs of bagpipes, and they have souvenirs of the Loch Ness Monster playing bagpipes. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> you know what's not cute? Bah! theory comes in, right? Because uh, I think the scientists, they have found the Loch Ness Monster um, and it was a sturgeon. And so <laughs> they knew they'd have to do a big cover-up, right? So I reckon what they did for the cover-up is they just sort of like painted the bits of him that stick out of the water green and then just like strapped a plesiosaur head to him like that. <laughs> <laughs> But I don't know if you guys have noticed, uh, but I'm a little bit creative. Uh, <laughs> and if it was me, I'd like to do a few fancy ones, you know? Uh, like I'd like to do one of the sturgeon dressed up as a giraffe. <laughs> People would just be like, what's he doing swimming in the lock? <laughs> How'd he get here from Africa? <laughs> the, the next one is, a, is another one I like. Um, and it's sturgeon dressed up as the Titanic. <laughs> got an iceberg on his head. <laughs> uh, tragedy's funny, isn't it? <laughs> um, 
And the next one is the last one, and it's my favourite, and it's the sturgeon dressed up as an aqua bus, <laughs> right? <laughs> Um, and the reason that one's my favourite is because there are no aqua buses on Loch Ness. Um, and I like to imagine the conversation that happens between the tourist who saw the aqua bus uh, and the guy who works behind the ticket desk selling tours, <laughs> you know? <laughs> and the tourist is like, two tickets to the aqua bus, please. <laughs> and the guy who works behind the ticket desk is like, there is no aqua bus. <laughs> People see shit on the lock all the time that doesn't exist. <laughs> Some guy the other day saw a giraffe. <laughs> anyway, that's me for tonight, guys. Thank you.